Hey gang, um, let's see, you guys, some of you had a question about number nine on the midterm and I told you that I would show you the math on that. Uh, I've done another video clip for number 11 as well, so look for that if you need it. But again, number nine, uh, it simply reads, a house has an outstanding mortgage of $21,275. If the seller wants to net $50,000 after paying off the mortgage and a 6% commission, what amount must the sales price be? So I remind you that this is a net, let me uh, get my pen going, a net to seller problem. Again, you've got several examples in your math notebook. Um, but also remember when you've got a net to seller problem, the formula that you need to remember is seller expenses divided by 100% minus the commission rate. Oops. Sorry. Make sure I get this right. Okay, so 100% minus whatever commission percentage is indicated in the problem. And then that's going to equal, guys, the sales price. That is your formula. So again, seller expenses divided by 100% minus the commission rate equals the sales price, which in this question, that's what it's asking us, is what is the sales price? So we need to determine <clears throat> what, first of all, our seller expenses are in order to calculate this question, this problem. So our expenses are the mortgage, right, at 21275 And then because this seller wants to net $50,000 from the sale of this house, we're going to have to consider that as an expense, too, for this problem. So these are the only two numbers given to us in the problem. So we'll add those up. And again, consider these the seller expenses. When I do that, I come up with 71,275. Check my math. All right. And now that I have this seller expenses, I need to divide by the commission rate minus the 100% or 100% minus the commission rate, excuse me. So let's draw a T-bar since that's what we're familiar with. Good practice. Let's label it. This is the whole, this is the rate, and this is the part at the top. Is seller expenses considered the whole or the part? Well, it's going to be in this case considered apart because the question is asking us to solve for the sales price, which is what the whole is. All right. So this is what we've got to solve for. So we've got the part of 71,275. That is again, the mortgage payoff and the commission, uh, excuse me, the net proceeds to the seller. Okay. The rate again, we have in the question as 6%. And oftentimes where students go wrong here is they put 6%. But remember, in a net to seller problem, it's always going to be 100 minus the commission rate. All right. So in that case, we're going to indicate 94% here. That's 100% minus 6% equals 94. Now, we've got two parts to our uh, T-bar, and we can do the math. 71,275 divided by 94%. And I've done the math already. That's 75,824, which is, again, what we are solving for. So the question is asking, what amount must the sales price be in order for this seller to pay off the mortgage and still walk away with 50 grand? And the answer to that, again, is 75824, or C, on your midterm. I hope this helps. If you need further explanation, clarity, have questions, don't hesitate to reach out. And remember to be reviewing your math workbook. All right.